afternoon. I'm Nicole Austin with your Kingsport Chamber Weekly Update. The 4th of July fireworks will take place this Saturday at 9.45 p.m. They're going to be shot from two different locations, one on Eastman Road and one in the downtown vicinity, so there's plenty of opportunities for viewing. We ask that you remain in your vehicles, if possible, for the safety of everyone and under the guidance of the health department. If you do need to leave your vehicles, we ask that you practice social distancing from others and remember to wear your mask. Your Kingsport Chamber will be closed this Friday, July the 3rd, in celebration of Independence Day. Healthy Kingsport still has the Mind Over Miles um, Step Challenge. Download the Walker Tracker app and get step in today. That challenge will continue through August the 1st, so it's not too late to get your steps in. And I want to tell you about our Cosby program. Um, have partnered with the U.S. Small Business Administration, East Tennessee State University, and the Tennessee Small Business Development Centers with um, supplemental grant funding through the CARES Act to provide training and business advising to small businesses that have uh, experienced a disruption in their supply chain, those that have had staffing changes, um, those that had to, resulted in a closure or loss of customers, all as a result of COVID-19. This assistance is going to be provided at zero cost to the business owners. Um, and it's going to be a one to four hour maximum of the counseling services. They have counseling services for um, different consultants that's going to assist your business in helping you get back up on your feet um, through some of these consulting services. So they're contracting with private consultants. There's going to be no cost to the business owners. They're going to provide up to four hours maximum training for your business. To find out if you qualify this or for more information, go to Cosby.org or KingsportChamber.org for more information on your program. We want to make sure that we're able to help out as many of you as possible. Um, and finally, I wanted to give you a bit of good news to end our um, video on. This past Saturday, the Miracle Field and um, Playground opened at Brickyard Park. I um, want to thank all of our sponsors that made that possible. And a special thank you to our friend and co-worker Judd Teague for all his heart and soul that he poured into making that a reality in our region. It's a really unique um, facility that's going to allow students of all, our kids of all abilities to participate in a game of baseball. So make sure you check that out. You're going to drive on Judd Teague Way to get there at Brickyard Park and check out the brand new Miracle Field facility. So big thank you to all of our sponsors and big thank Thank you to Judd Teague for making that dream into a reality. I hope you stay well, stay positive, and have a great week.